Welcome to Bread from the Potter. This message was received from the Lord Jesus on December the 28th, 2017. The title of the message is Sudden Change. And the Lord Jesus began. Change is coming, children. Most people are not even aware of it. For them, it is life as usual. But the spiritually astute can see the clouds churning and feel the wind of change. No one has the faintest idea how much life on earth will change. It will be swift. It will be sudden. It will be shocking. This is the way it has always been. When change comes, it is not always gradual. Most of the time, it is sudden and unexpected. In one day, the flood came. For years, Noah had prophesied the coming flood, and then in one day, the heavens opened and the fountains of the deep were broken up. In one day, Israel walked free out of Egypt. It was so sudden, they barely had time to pack their belongings. In a day, Israel and Judah went into captivity. What had been prophesied for centuries came down to a matter of hours. In one day, a Savior was born upon the earth. Yes, Mary was pregnant for the expected time. But on the day she gave birth, one era ended and a new one began. Calvary was a one-day experience, the beginning of the end of the kingdom of darkness. On Pentecost, in one day, the Holy Spirit came down from my Father to live on earth in the hearts of men who accepted me, Jesus, as their Lord and Savior. Fast forward, and in one day, a nation was born, the nation of Israel in modern times. In one day, a day not too far away, War will erupt between Israel and her neighbors, a war that will temporarily cease only with the intervention of the Antichrist. In one day, my bride will be caught up to me, rescued from a rapidly darkening world, and in one day I will return as King of Kings, Lord of Lords, the ruler over nations, Prince of Peace, to bring true peace to Jerusalem, to Israel, to the entire world. A time when swords will become plowshares and men will dwell in peace in unwalled cities again. My word lives. My word is true. My word will be fulfilled as written. No one can change the course of the set times. It is only my father's mercy that delays the events ordained to take place as written in my word. No man on earth can erase what is to come. Yes, the prayers of my children have moved my father to withhold his judgments thus far, but they are coming, and the only ones who will fare well are my children. Yes, they will go through persecution, but their destiny is assured as long as they remain faithful to me. Man has a tendency to forget the lessons of the past. Time creates a fog of forgetfulness that lulls him into complacency. I have sent, and I am sending many signs, especially in nature, in the form of natural disasters, in an attempt to jolt him out of his place of sleep. But many, including my own children, are still asleep. It is going to take a major disaster for my own church to rise from her place of deep sleep. Well, children, it is coming, shocking events that will jolt my church from her deep slumber. Stay alert. Wait and watch. Jesus. Amen. And that was the end of the message from the Lord Jesus. Be blessed, beloved.